<laughs> Let's now have Pia Bonello. She's at the Philippine Science Center in Marikina. Hi, Pia. Jeng, let me be honest with you. I was never a big fan of science when I was growing up. But here at the Philippine Science Centrum, they found a way to make science fun. With me is museum guide Robert Bautista to tell us all about it. Good morning, Robert. Good morning, ma'am. Can you tell me, ano-ano bang mga branches ng science ang matututunan ng mga bata and matatanda alike here in Philippine Science Center. Okay po ma'am. So marami po tayong branches or galleries na tinatawag sa Philippine Science Center. So we have po yung Space Gallery, uh, Earth Science, Infectious Disease, we have the Liquids, uh, the Lights Gallery, Electricity, and mecha the Mechanics, Body Works, and at the same time we have the Illusion Walls. Wow, and dami naman pwedeng matutunan ng mga bata. As soon as we got here, we were so interested dun sa anti-gravity wall. Can you explain ano ba nangyayari doon? So, ang anti-gravity po of Philippine Science Center is actually one of our highlight that proves that our body is bilateral symmetry. So, yun po yung tinatawag natin. Ano ba yung meron sa katawan natin? Bakit siya nahahati in equal part? Yan po yung makikita sa anti-gravity mirror. Ayun, tapos parang it gives you the illusion na parang lumuluta. Actually, ma'am, yun po yun. Pwede kang gumawa ng tricks gamit lamang po yung simple or plain mirror na tinatawag natin. Okay, and then there is also this exhibit naman with bubbles. Ano naman yung natuturo ng bubbles sa mga tao? Yes, ma'am. So nakita natin kanina yung two sets ng bubbles sa aming liquids gallery. So pinapakita nun, ano mo yung basic na principle ng surface tension. So kapag sinabi natin surface tension, yun yung use pala nakikita, thin layer sa soap. So kaya hindi siya pumuputok dahil sa word na surface tension. Oh, okay. And then, meron din kayong mga demos of like the different weather changes dito sa Philippines, especially mga earthquake. Meron din kayong exhibit about that. Meron po. Meron po kaming uh, Earth Science Gallery. So, makikita natin yung tsunami or yung greenhouse effect, kung paano ba yung pag-emit ng carbon dioxide sa space. So, meron dito. Tapos meron din yung pwede mong ma-feel yung different na mga magnitudes ng earthquake? Yes, ma'am. Meron po kaming feel the shake. Makikita natin yung magnitude number 2 to number 6 sa earthquake simulator. Okay, and then meron din tayo about naman the human body where you get to ride the bicycle and then kasabay mo yung skeleton. Can yes. you explain that to me as well? Yan po yung watch me pedal. Yung pinakang basic application po niyan, makikita nung bata ano ba yung movement during nagbabike. So makikita niya yung movement ng kanyang uh, lower leg, yung bones of her, of her or his feet, yung makikita natin yung femur, yung thigh. So makikita yun sa watch me pedal. And then madami tayo mga optical illusions. Meron din yung nagmumukhang pugot yung ulo ng tao. Ayan po yung tinatawag nating power of reflection. So usually po, yun yung ginagamit sa magic. So meron lang siyang salamin sa harap. So pag yung three steps away, yung tao na manonood, makikita niya na parang pugot yung ulo. And then this has always been curious to me. Yung kapag tumataas yung balahibo mo, di ba, you always feel that. But then meron dito parang nagsisimulate hanggang yung buhok. Can you explain that as well? Yung tinatawag po nating band grab, so parang si Mr. Bean, yun po yung static or positive charges. So lahat kapag gumawa ka sa bola, ma-absorb mo. Since yung hair natin, yung pinakang light part, makikita mo yung pagtaas ng buhok using uh, or absorbing positive charges or static. So kahit sino, basta medyo long ang hair, pwede namang maramdaman yun. Yes po ma'am. And then here, dito sa Space Gallery, meron din tayong, anong gagawin nito? Ay nako, ayan, iikot si ate. Anong mangyayari dito? So ito po yung tinatawag nating human gyro ride or gyroscope ride ng Philippine Science Center, kung saan pinapakita nito yung basic or pinakang underground training ng astronaut na na-develop po sa NASA sa States. Oh, okay. So ano yung matuturo na tong training na to? Actually po, pag isa kang astronaut, makikita mo ano ba yung feeling ng zero gravity pag nasa space ka. So para ma-feel mo yon, kailangan mag-undergo ka po ng basic training. Yan po yung human gyro ride. Okay, this is totally safe naman or may guidelines ba tayo? Lahat ba pwedeng sumakay dyan? May limit ma'am kami from your weight, it should be 45 to 55 kilograms. Tapos your height should be 49 to 55 lamang po yung magtatry. To those of you out there who are already curious and would want to explore a whole new world of science that is actually fun, please do invite everyone. San ba makikita tong Philippine Science Center? So, ang Philippine Science Center is located sa Ecom Building dito po sa Riverbank Center, Marikina City. So, meron po kaming website, uh, Philippine Science Center. The sent room that VH or contact number 9425136 or 9424137. So, sa mga gusto pong mag walk ins or mag field trips, contact nyo lang po kami. Magkano naman ang ticket? Ang admission fee po namin is 120 pesos po per head. Wow, see, it's really um, inexpens an inexpensive way to explore the world of science. So, all, so to all of you out there, it's about time for you to discover that science can indeed be fun here at the Philippine Science Centrum. Jing, Amelin.
Thanks, Pia. Thanks, Pia. Do you see the bad hair day machine? Yeah. yeah. One yeah. day, I'm going to go back to the bubble.